Welcome to SNAP, Confirmer's Reporting and Reconciliation Tool. Reports, Deployments and Invoice Reminders. In this video, we'll show you how to run a standard transaction report and to create custom reports. You'll learn how to search for deployments, find associated details and add new invoices. Finally, we'll give you an overview on how to send invoice reminders to suppliers who have not yet submitted an invoice. To run a standard report, select the Reporting tab and follow the steps on screen. Select a card pool, a spend type, choose your report type, select one of the reports displayed, and choose a statement reference period. Click Run Report to view your results. Use the scroll bar to see more data fields. You can download and save your reports by clicking Download. Create bespoke reports by clicking Customize Reports. Select the report type you want to customize. Give your report a name. Choose the column headers to be included in your report. Use the arrows to move them across. and click Customize. Scroll down for a preview of your custom report. Your new report will appear in the report drop-down list for use in the future. Let's recap. You can run a standard transaction report by spend type, card pool, and statement reference. You can also create your own custom reports. Next, let's look at searching for deployments, finding associated details and adding new invoices. To begin, select the Deployment tab. Choose a spend type, then a card pool, and enter a date range within a three-month period. Choose a deployment status, and click Search to run your report. Search results will be displayed here. Select an ID to view the deployment in more detail. Key deployment details are shown here. You can see further details such as the tick showing that this deployment has been matched to a transaction. You can see an overview of matched invoices and view the invoice in more detail. In SNAP, the term invoice refers to the manual entry of invoice details. To return to the deployment screen, click View Deployment. View linked documents here. In SNAP, the term document refers to the actual copy of a supplier invoice. You can choose to create a new invoice against the document ID. Select Options and click Create New Invoice. This will allow you to manually add an invoice line item breakdown. Enter the required details, the check-in and check-out date, the invoice reference number, and the cost. Then scroll down to save your invoice. Your new invoice has been added successfully. You've now seen how to search for deployments using various options such as spend type, statement reference and date range, and whether a deployment has been matched. We've shown you how to view insightful data by deployment ID and how to find useful linked document details. Now let's look at sending invoice reminders. First, select the Invoice Reminders tab. Next, select a card pool. Then, enter a date range within a three-month period. Click the Search button to continue. The deployments and transactions requiring an invoice will be displayed here. The reminder will be sent by email or fax. The communication method is displayed on this screen. To send your reminder, 
put a tick against the relevant deployment or transaction. Click Send to issue the reminder. A banner will be displayed confirming that your invoice reminder has been sent successfully. You should now feel comfortable in the process for sending invoice reminders by card pool, statement reference and date range, supplier name, deployment ID, and number of reminders already sent. We hope this video has given you all the information you need on the topic. If you do require any further information, please go to help.confirmer.com.